Hi, I'm Ray from Wildlife Control Supplies. And I'm going to show you how to set our tube traps, the WCS tube trap. We have two styles. We have a standard, and then we have the rust resistant. And what you basically want to do is you have three part, basic parts to this. You have your safety, you have a dog, and then you have what's called a strike bar. So you want to put your hands on the outside, two fingers on. You want to push the strike bar all the way down and lift the safety over the strike bar. That's probably the most important part of this trap is the safety on it. Once you have the safety on, you can take, push back down on here, you pull the dog up over the strike bar, and then you want to take your other hand, pull the pan up over the dog. So what happens now is your trap is set. Leave the safety on, and you want to take and put your baits inside for the squirrels. Then what you want to do is take your trap out to where you're going to put it, and the last thing you want to do is take the safety off, making the trap live. At this point, it's a live trap, the strike bar can't fire. So I'm going to put the safety back on. If you have a hard time setting this by hand manually, we have two types of setters. We have a lever, and we also have the scissors. What I'm going to do is undo this and then show you really quick how to set them with both types of setters. We'll do the lever first. What it does is it comes toward, I'm facing toward you. You want to put it all the way in and up. I'm going to turn a little bit just so you can see a little easier. It's very simple to just push down and you push all the way down until your strike bar reaches the lower bar. At that point you would put your safety on and then set the dog into the pan. With the scissors, what you would do is you open them up, you set, I'll show you on the side here, the bar into the scissors. Once that's done, you pull this up and you hook the top onto the strike bar as shown. Now you can pull it down. You can do it with two hands, you can leave it on the bottom, or you can just like this, and then you set your safety. Once you have this done, you can take this scissors off and it's set the exact same way as you would manually using the dog. I hope this demonstration has been helpful for you in setting our tube trap. Uh, thanks for watching. If you have any problems, you can always contact us and we'd be glad to help you with any problems with anything you have. Thank you.